Hey there, my name is Heatherly7 and this is going to be my let's play playthrough, whatever you call it, of Horizon Zero Dawn. I've never played this game, I'm a little late on the game, I know people were like super hyped for it when it came out, but I like playing games like six years later once they come out because either I haven't been able to get it or, or also just the fact that like now people who have played it get to watch me react to it. So yeah, hopefully you guys enjoy. What's that now? Don't like the cold? Can't stay in today. We have a ritual to perform, you and I. Here. Wear this. It belonged to my daughter. Good. Today, I speak your name, girl. But will the goddess speak it back? <laughs> Normally, it would be the mother who declares, if you had one. The whole village would attend, and matriarchs perform the ritual. But we are outcasts. Even so, we keep the tribe's rituals. Otherwise, we might become like the faithless old ones who turned their backs on the goddess. But their wickedness doomed them. To us, we're left the splendors of creation, beasts of air, Water, earth, and steel. It is one thing to hunt a beast, another to hunt a machine. You must be humble and respect their power. I will teach you this, one day. Matriarch Tirsa. What is she doing here? Does she mean to forbid the ritual? No, 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 off your knees. It's nearly time. And yes. You may speak to me. You came to bless the naming. Have not six months gone by since we entrusted her to you. But we are outcasts. You by choice. And she, well... <laughs> I am a high matriarch, Rost. I bless whom I choose. Then you honor us. Yes, yes, now go! And be ready to declare. Go! Oh, mother, this child needs a name by which to know her. That your love may warm her life as the rising sun warms all the earth. Speak her name! Aloy! And so her name is blessed. Stop this at once! What have you done? 
I've blessed the naming of a child. Stubborn woman, you call that curse a child? What did she tell you about his birth outcast? Answer! I've done only what you asked. To raise it, yes. We said nothing of love. Enough. And you, blessing its name like it was one I of the I know my duty to the them. Tribe. And to you. Without consultation. I'm here. And wherever you go, I will follow. Six years later, apparently. She's an outcast, isn't she? Oh, well this is gonna That's be one of those. Th this is gonna be one of those. Like, if you talk to her, you get like banned Children, from the clan come situation. With me. She's an outcast to be shunned. She not dead from that. Rost! Down here! Rost! Also, Rost! I realized I realized through like the intro movie that her, won't hear me. that her name is basically Alloy. Some kind like, of cave? She, they, they all have metal names, kind of like. So her name is Alloy, but it's Alloy. And then, um, Rost is, like, supposed to be Rust, I guess. Ugh! Oh, God. Fucking bats, no. Looks tight, but I can get through. This must be a ruin of the metal world. One of the old places. Is this a laboratory? This is, okay, this is kind of cool. Although now I'm curious where that other cave led. Oh, C is the crouch. Okay. Not bad. Hopefully nothing used the R and T button because that's what I used to record. Oh, maybe this is where she fell. Oh, this is like literally the same pathway. Oh, my bad. Okay. Good to know. I never like missing anything. God, I cannot wait to get into this game already. The graphics are freaking amazing, and oh my goodness. Ross said never go in places like this. But I have to find a way out. Also, I'm very curious about what's going on in the laboratory. So cool. Hmm. 
There's something up ahead. What's that? A dead person. Oh my god, it's a dead person. There's something shiny there. Last time she was able to do the cool future stuff because I have seen like little bits and pieces of people like playing this. Well, technically, one person playing this. And basically, I would just lurk. Not really watch the story. I know it's about hunting metallic robot creatures. That's that's literally all I know about it. Right. This is really cool. Oh, I love Everywhere. the fact that it's purple. I love purple, How as you do can this? tell. The, the frames and stuff. Yeah, so cool. I want to like scan the computers though. That's what I think would be really cool to do. A metal door, closed. Okay. Maybe this device I found can help. So it's blonde. A oh. shape. It's connected to the door somehow. Okay. It's funny because this is just basically like another version of like Eagle Vision or whatever it's called. And I've always wondered like, um, which game came out with Eagle, like the whole like x-ray type vision like this, you know? Because I swear it was Assassin's Creed, but I don't know if that's entirely true. I'm just also curious, can I like go and check out like the computer and stuff and like, I don't know, find out cool stuff about the future? That would be, that'd be very fun. Changed color. Okay. And maybe now I can open up the door. Maybe. The door changed color too. Like come back here later when we run out for something. Um, What's that? It's got a device. a device. Like the. You think I want it this way? It's the best I can do. He's right behind you. Hi. <laughs> Happy birthday, Isaac. Daddy sure does love his little big man. Look, Daddy can't be there with you and Mom, but we can still have a party, right? <laughs> sure we can. <laughs> Show me. Show me again. I can do. He's right behind you. Hi. Hi. <laughs> Happy birthday, Isaac. Daddy sure does love his little big man. Look, Daddy can't be there with you and Mom, but... We can still have a party, right? <laughs> sure we can. <laughs> Happy birthday, Isaac. Daddy sure does love his little big man. 
Oh. Okay, I swear this game is gonna make me fucking cry because of like emotional moments where like she feels super lonely and I'm all for it. It's gonna make me very sad. What is this? Like, oh, I wanna kinda go back and see if I can like scan that thing that was upstairs with the, the speaker button because she just figured out how to scan that one thing so I wonder if she'll be able to scan this now. I'm curious. Director Evans, flash traffic from USRC. Black quartz encryption. I've rooted the message to your hollow grid for viewing. What? Okay. What the heck? See, this is where I want to go back and scan stuff. Hmm. Let's see if I can scan stuff. That's cool, you can tag targets. Oh, okay. Well, anyways. Okay, I'm gonna get out of here. Let's squeeze through. Oh, another thingy. God, there's more dead people here. So like, obviously this is water. So there was like an ice age. Oh my God, what if there was an ice age? That'd be crazy. I saw them lining up in the community room, like cattle in a slaughterhouse, but smiling at each other. Shauna handing out meds, like being alive is some kind of pain to be eased. Well, not me. I don't want to go quiet. I don't want to trail off. I want a period at the end of my life sentence, not an ellipsis. Hell, <laughs> an exclamation mark. So if that upsets whoever finds this, too bad. I don't know anyone, anything anymore. Oh my God. Okay then. Uh that happened. God. Well, happy new year, dear diary. Can you believe we actually celebrated last night? Well, we did. Kind of. Director Evans invited everyone to gather in the community room. I don't know where she got the party hats. That was a ghoulish touch. So they always sit watching the clock tick down to midnight, and I'm thinking, am I the only one who gets the symbolism of this? It might have been worth it if Skylar had gotten drunk again, but I seem to be a mistake she doesn't want to repeat. Why did they die here? What happened to them? Me? Like, that's what I'm wondering. I mean, seriously? Record our thoughts for posterity. Great idea, Director Evans. That's like, I haven't okay. done enough for posterity already. Like, I wouldn't be here like this if not for posterity. I'm done with posterity. Posterity can go. Oh, Notebook. What happened to the other... Machu and Machu Picchu. Always wanted to see that. Okay, interesting. This is so cool, though. And pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. I mean, uh, death. I'm sorry. It's been a while. And, whoa, these meds Johnny gave us are really something. So, uh, Okay, from the top, kids. 
Hail Mary, full of grace. And maybe that's all I need, you know? That moment the door opened and you were standing there wearing that retro wave dress and the way you smiled. I had to look away or you were gonna see. He found me. Ross found me. Down here. I didn't hear the rest of that. I'm coming. I'm coming. Oh, sorry. I hit that space bar by accident. Oh, mother be praised. Come, girl. Take my hand. You don't belong down there. Come. Uh, uh, <sighs> it was really cool. I saw this Such guy. He wasn't actually man. there. And I actually made in. the They're of the metal me. world. What is that on your face? Nothing. Did you find it down there? No. Give it to me. But it's mine and it's cool and lets me. Hey, Lloyd. Dude, Such stop. things are dangerous. No! <sighs> well, if you're gonna go sneaking away from home, you'll need to know how to survive in the wild. Come, Aloy. Home now. But starting tomorrow, you will learn to hunt. muttering to that plaything. We descend to the valley now. But it's cool. Follow. It categorizes all my items. The wilds can be dangerous, Aloy. You will need to stay close and do as I say. I know. Now. You're still scratched up from that fall you took yesterday. So let's start there. Take this medicine pouch. I'll show you how to fill it. See this plant over here? It's called salve brush. Come, gather its berries in your pouch. Sure. Hey, Lloyd, come now. I'm doing that good. it. Guys. Now eat the berries. <laughs> They may taste bitter, enjoy the but they can save your oh life. God, this is... Always keep your pouch full of medicinal berries, flowers, and plants. Gotcha. Where are we? Gathering is a must. This valley is just a part of all mother's embrace. Embrace. The Nora tribe watches these lands and keeps out the most dangerous machines, usually. So fucking beautiful. Further down river, we'll find a herd of machines, and I will teach you how to hunt. Are they dangerous? All machines are dangerous, Aloy. Their power must be respected. But I will be beside you. <laughs> That's so cute. Aloy, a machine's coming. Okay. Crouch and follow me into the tall grass. I just want to sprint into it. Maybe something. There. Now stay low. They don't it totally no saw me. <laughs> running Such in there. Such machines are called watchers. You must it's learn terrible. to avoid their gaze. If you are to survive in the wilds, okay. I will show you. Listen close and do as I do. Stay still. Wait for it to pass. Now keep low and follow me across the trail to that tall grass. Oh, 
Another one. Let it pass. So cool. Come, back this way. The slower you move. Wait for oh, it. I totally went the wrong fucking way. Oops. That's the last of them. Let's move on. Well, they didn't see or hear you. Now stay close. That herd should be just ahead. Oh, that gets some kid. Who's that? Ignore him. But why is he up there? at us. Deb! Get back where you belong! Deb! Where are you? Ignore him. We are outcasts and he is of the tribe. Maybe he doesn't like the tribe. Then he is a fool. Come now. Let's find that herd. Follow. Totally not going to be like romantic interest in the future or anything like that. Or like future best friend. Come on, Rost. You there. So See them? These are called striders. Ha! Get! Why'd you chase them off? <sighs> to show you how some machines startle easily if they detect you and run away. They're best approached by stealth. Don't worry. We'll catch up with them further down the valley. You'll see. I was collecting rocks. I like rocks. Now, I want you to find some rocks that fit the cup of your hand. I just did Why? that. Do as I say, Aloy, and gather the rocks. I will show you how to use them. Those will do. Follow. Collecting all the rocks and plants that I see. Rocks can't hurt machines, right? No, but they can distract them, draw them into traps. Like that watcher over there. It must be dealt with, or it will warn the herd and send them running before we get in range. Warn them? How? The machines speak to each other, Aloy, unless they are first silenced. Now you stay here on the ridge. On my signal, throw rocks and draw the watcher over to me. Wait for my signal. Okay. Throw a rock near me. This would be cool in the future and stuff. To, like taking down ourselves. There. Come, girl, it's safe now. Harvest the kill so I can teach you how to make arrows. Good. Now, gather stalks of Ridgewood from the plants over there.
Use the stocks as arrow shafts and metal shards for our heads. Ooh, Good. You'll never run out of arrows if you know how to craft what you need. Gotcha. Let's put those arrows to use. Follow. Yes, Pa. Maybe I'll just call you Pa every time I talk to you. Here. Stay low on the grass and be quiet. So I shoot them? I'm just gonna shoot it in the face. It's time to make your first oh, kill, Probably should actually listen to the beam. The Strider. One of the weaker machines. Mm -hmm. But even a weak machine can kill a hunter if she's careless. You must study your prey. Its hide is thick, but there are spots where it is vulnerable. Like its eye. Can you guess another? Oh, we'll be able to scan it now. That's funny. on its back. Is that a weakness? Yes. How did you guess that? The device. It showed me. That's cool. But that plaything? Stop playing games. Now, take down that strider. Target the eye or the cat. Hit! Keep firing! Got it. Okay. You did well today. But you have much to learn. Tomorrow, we train again. What was that? That boy. The one running the brave trails. Also, what the fuck is that? Follow Eloy, is quick! Is like a metal lizard thing? Oh, we are going now. Cross the road. Oh. What just happened? Stop oh, this telling cool. stories. I'm not telling stories. Believe me, Pa. I can do it, Pa. I'm not. I can sneak through. You will not. This will be interesting. So we can Oh that's oh cool. Okay. We need to do this slowly and quietly. So now he's gonna go. Let them see me. Okay, I'm gonna be... Is this going that way 
person. Oh no. The watcher saw me. Damn it, now I'm dead. To move slowly. I thought he was going in the so other way. So my bad. I thought he was going that way. I mean, it's actually kind of funny that the grass is red and her hair is red too. So, like, I just think it's funny. <laughs> they told totally to see their paths. Almost there. There he is. We just have to tag that one. Although it's pretty easy to see that he's just gonna go over there. Let them see me. You okay, bro? Hey. What? How, how is this? Shh. Follow me. Now we just have to get out of here. They're literally walking away from me. How is this possible? This part is actually like scarily easy. Which is funny. Nope, and it's gonna stick on my face forever. Also, I have a theory that she's a robot. Wait, but maybe it doesn't make sense now because girl. she's grown up. You both. I don't know. I have Why? a theory save me. that this girl is not the I, same. I just Boy! Seal your lips. He was just thinking us for saving his life. They are outcasts both. And she is motherless. And that's not her fault. Come now. Back to Mother's heart. And you. <laughs> that boy should not have spoken to us. It's against tribal law. Well, he we'll said like six now. sentences to me. So. Follow. Yeah. I know the way. Stay away, no mother. Hmm. 
Ooh, I can use compassion, insight, or confront. Interesting. Um, obviously this is a good choice. Evil choice, neutral choice. Um, I'm gonna be smart. Oh, hey. Oh, it's dead hurt. So rude. Oh, you're bleeding. Let me have a look. Here, hold still. I'll get it. Why? Shh. Why am I an outcast? Aloy, this is not the time. Really? Who was my mother? Aloy, they like literally. I've told you before. That's not for us to know. You were just a newborn when the matriarchs brought you to me. So the matriarchs, they know? It's not so simple. But they know. Aloy, we are outcasts. So how do I make them tell me? The matriarchs? There is a way, perhaps. So tell me. It would be dangerous. How? It would take years of training. I don't care. How do I do it? Tell me! The proving. The tribe's rite of passage held every year. Those who pass become braves. But to the one who wins, the matriarchs grant a boon. A boon? Yes, whatever the winner wants. Then I'll do it. <laughs> whatever it takes. I'll win the proving. <sighs> I see. We'd best get started then. Your training will be hard. And it will take years. Start training? Yes. Follow. Oh, so cute. Time for a training montage. Gave the you're ready nod. Mm, training is over. You are now 18. I do love that though. Rost! That Ashley Birch voices. Rost! Aloy. Rost! And also, um, I love the fact that there's going to be like little. 
little Two choices. Two days before approving, and he goes off without me. He wouldn't do that. Like the like the compassion insight thing. This is gonna be freaking awesome. Ooh, level three. Well, time to go find Ross. Ooh, you can unlock skills. Uh, what was that the inch button? Oh my goodness. Oh. Well, I see we're gonna have a map to explore. Crafting. Can you modify it? That is cool. Oh, fire arrows. Nice. Uh, special items. Ooh. That's cool. I think that might have to do with the, um, um, I think that has to do with the DLC stuff I have. Machine catalog. Oh, that's actually really cool. Oh, and it tells you what you can get for it. So in case I ever need to go hunting for a certain creature or whatever, or certain ingredients, that is cool. Your spirit can knock off machine time. Wait, what? My spear? Got their attention. Oh, that's cool. Okay. So that's how I can like hit creatures and like um be able to, you know, deal some massive damage, or if they're really tough. Okay, so that's how I knock off armor, and then this is just like a power attack. Yeah. <laughs> that's fucking nice. Oh my goodness. Um, I'm just gonna grab some new stuff. Oh, and of course, campfires for saving. Need them soon enough. Oh yeah, we still got our rocks. But yeah, we're gonna miss.